Today I am tackling a little chicken coop makeover. Um, it's not huge, but I figured since I'm doing it anyways, I might as well take you guys along with me. This is what the chicken coop looks like right now. We just had some new chickens, so that's why we have these in here because we let them out. So they've been sitting there like that. We had some molting happening, so we have some feathers in here. Um, but let's get everything cleared out of here first. Now that everything is cleared out as far as like things go, it's time to use our shovel and scrape up everything on the ground. Now everything is officially taken out, nesting box included, but now it is time to pressure wash the coop. So let's get started. So this is what the coop looks like, completely pressure washed. Franny will not go away. She wants to be in here the whole time, but did a really good job in here with the pressure wash. We're gonna let it dry. So I just wanna paint it all white and do a couple other things. It's prepped, it's ready, it's clean enough to get painted. Now this whole thing is about to turn white. I hope it looks good. I've seen a lot of people do like shiplap and then paint it white, which I'm just going right on um, this metal. So I don't know. I really wanna keep it metal because it washes off really nicely, especially with it being painted, it's gonna wash off even better. So I'm thinking that, I wonder what this is. It might've been like a patch, maybe. I don't know, we're gonna keep it there for now. But I got my sprayer ready i really want to do those i don't know if i'm gonna do those yet today or not but we've got the sprayer ready made a huge mess in the process i got my white paint and it's time to paint it's like five o'clock right now and my chickens go up in the next like two hours so i need to hurry up and get this painted so that it can dry by the time that they're ready so let's get started So this is what the coop looks like right now. It's all finished being painted after um, a Home Depot run, running out of paint and a bunch of stuff. And um, it's really dark out now. So hopefully I did this good enough, but it's just a chicken coop. I got new two by fours at Home Depot. I got a lot of paint on my window that I'll scrape off tomorrow. So now we are going to spray paint the nesting boxes. We just blew them out with the blower and I'm just painting them with spray paint just because I feel like this is the easiest route to go. It's not like a huge thing anyways. 
so here's what the nesting box looks like i think it turned out really nice i left it out here so that they can lay some eggs so i got two eggs for today okay the bars are out as you can see they're all gone and the window is clean that was super satisfying super easy to do too get these roost bars back up really quick and then hopefully i can put some bedding in and i'll get the nesting box up later when mike's here to help me because it's a little heavy and i lifted off the ground a little bit so we'll see how that goes but let's get these bars back up Y'all, that was terribly hard. Patience for this type of stuff is not my strong suit, so I should have just waited for Mike. But hey, I got it done. I felt really weak. <laughs> that was so hard. Oh my gosh, I felt like it took me forever, but it looks really good. Now I'm gonna do the little slant roof for the top of it. I love the black in here, it looks so good. Hope it encourages them to lay because of the darkness of it. So we'll see. I'm gonna try to get some curtains and stuff for them just to make it super cute. But not for right now, I'm exhausted. I wanna get this like roof thing on and hopefully I do it well. Look how good that this is gonna look. I'm so excited for it. Okay, so cute. I'm obsessed. I put that piece right there so that the chickens couldn't get underneath that. I love it. Oh my gosh. I'm literally so obsessed with this. I'm gonna put the bedding down on the ground so they can't ruin it anymore. Add um, their food and water back in here because it is getting a little bit dark out and the chickens will probably be headed up here soon. But like, just look how cute this looks. I have blue eggs right here and it pops so much against these nesting boxes now. So cute. I'm in love. So the chickens have been in their coop now for a couple days with the current renovations. Franny, you're so goofy. And this is what it's looking like. Of course, they're already pooping a bit on my new roost bars, but that's fine. That's what they're there for. Really simple fix to keep fixing them if I need to. But now today we are going to paint the frames of these windows black. And then I was almost thinking about painting these black, but I think I'm just gonna leave them the raw wood. I like the way that it looks. So then this window frame will need to get painted black. I really wanted to leave this like raw wood as the raw wood element over here, but I've oversprayed it so much. So I think it might just look clean if I just paint it black. I don't know. I do have this as my wood element in here. But we'll see, I gotta think about it while I do the outlines of these frames for the windows first 
and I probably will most likely paint that black. We'll see though, but for now, first things first is painting the frames black. it for my chicken coop renovation so let's give you guys a final tour of the whole thing but first we need to reflect on what it looked like before we did the whole renovation because it looks so different All right, you guys, well, I hope you liked today's chicken coop renovation video. I love doing this. This was actually very impromptu for me. This all started when I cleaned the coop out and I decided that it had good bones at that point to renovate it. And I absolutely love the way that it looks. It's so much more cute. It's so much cuter now and I can't wait to actually decorate it. I wanna get curtains for the nest boxes, like I mentioned, some signs. I actually went to Trash Supply yesterday, couldn't find any chicken signs. So if you guys have any recommendations for good chicken signs, let me know in the comments down below. But also let me know if you guys wanna see that video when I do redecorate, cause I wanna make it super cute and everything like that. And then especially when we make our run. So that is it for today's video. If you guys liked seeing this chicken coop renovation, make sure you go and give this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel below. Make sure you turn on those post notifications so you don't miss any videos like this. I do pick one comment from every video to be my shout out. So today's shout out goes to. All right, you guys, I love you and I'll see you in the next one.